There are various different scenarios when it comes to selecting objects, so this next part deals with object selection. I've added some colour in order to highlight the individual objects better. Left clicking on an object will select that object. Control A selects all objects. If the first object is selected, shift clicking on the last object will select all objects in between. You can select next or previous objects by holding down shift plus the left and right arrows. These are the ones to the left of the question mark. Shift clicking diagonally will select all the objects inside that area. You can deselect individual objects by control left clicking on the selected object. Maybe you want to copy a particular selection of objects to another part of an arrangement. One way would be to control select the objects. And then control drag to copy them to the new location. To lasso select, left click in an adjacent empty space and draw the lasso selection over the objects you wish to select. Again by holding down control you can copy these objects to a new part of the arrangement. You can also use a temporary lasso by using the hotkey control alt plus L if you want to select a bunch of objects not accessible by lassoing from the edge. This command will only work for that one time. There is also a command called switch selection. Above that is deselect objects. Although sometimes it will be faster to just click in an empty area to deselect objects. You can select objects that are under the play cursor by using the menu item Object, Select Objects, Select Objects. Position the play cursor over the objects and use that command. There's also a menu item called Select Objects in Active Track. If you're on version 11, you can also select all objects for the active track by double clicking in an empty space on that track. So by using a mixture of hotkeys, menu items and modifiers, it's possible to customise your working methods.